Today let's do some Caribbean spicy shrimp. We're going to start off by cleaning our shrimp. They're already deveined. We're going to remove the shells from them. These shrimp are a 16 to 20 count. And to give you an idea what size they are, you can use a larger shrimp if you want. I wouldn't recommend anything smaller. Now to our ingredients. Apart from our shrimp and our pineapple cubes, we're going to need some wood skewers. There's the ingredients for our marinade. And there's the ingredients for our jerk seasoning. Now you're going to want to grind that jerk seasoning up in an electric coffee grinder into a fine powder. First we're going to clean off these habanero peppers. Now, two things about these. Number one, make sure you wear gloves. Number two, do not run these underwater while you're doing it. If you do, they will create a gas that will get into your lungs. You want to clean out the seeds and any white that may be in there. Unlike a jalapeno, these don't retain the heat in that white. They retain it in the flesh of the fruit. We're going to put those into a blender along with the rest of our marinade ingredients and blend those to a juice. Now we need a non-reactive pan here because we got a lot of acid in here. We're going to start with our skewers with a chunk of pineapple and a shrimp. Just going to alternate until we fill up the skewer. With our container full, we're going to go ahead and take our marinade pour it over top of this. We want to marinate these for 30 minutes. Okay, there's a lot of lime juice and pineapple juice in here. It has a lot of acid. If you marinate this too long, that acid will actually cook that shrimp the same way it would do with ceviche. So you don't want to marinate them too long. They're 30 minutes up. I'm going to put them out on the chopping board. And we're going to sprinkle our jerk seasoning over them. Like I say, don't go too heavy with this. This stuff's spicy and it's hot. So if you don't like real hot food, you're not going to want to put a lot of this on there. Sure, you flip them over, do both sides. Let's move outside to our char griller duo. We've got the grill preheated, it's nice and hot. We're going to cook these about three and a half minutes a side. It really depends upon the size of your shrimp. What you want to do is you want to cook these until the outside's nice and pink and that translucent center turns to a nice solid white. Don't want any translucents in the middle. After about three and a half minutes, we're going to turn them over. We're going to cook the other side. Now, with that done, we can go ahead and take these off the grill, take them inside. We can match these up with something nice and light for a nice summer evening meal. Here we've got a little rice dish and some light salad. Perfect light meal for a summer's evening. Enjoy.